Hello, pl get out of here. Welcome, Planeswalker, to One Pack Magic, where we open one pack of magic cards, as seen in hospitals. Now, today is day three of the Dominaria release weekend, so we're opening one more pack just to see what kind of goodies we get. And we're having a fight again. All right, come on. See you there. Oh. Nope, yep, nope. There we go. There we go. Doesn't it feel good to open up? I'm gonna hear about that. All right. Prayer of Binding. Oh, I like that. That is some good, I like that. I'm, that is some good art right there. All right. Swamp. Essence Scatter. A one blue instant counter target creature spell. Simple little unsummon. Charismatic Vanguard. A two white dwarf soldier for 3 2. With four white creatures you control get plus one plus one until end of turn. That's actually pretty good. Elfham Worm. A four green worm. For 5-4 with Vigilance and Trample. That's a, a basic green card. Talarian Geyser. Two blue sorcery with Kicker for one white. For white. Return target creature to its owner's hand. Draw a card. If this spell was kicked, you gain three life. Garna, Blood Fist of Keld. One black, red, red, legendary human berserker, 4-3. Whenever another creature you control dies, draw a card if it is, uh, was attacked. Otherwise, Garna cut, deals one damage to each opponent. Welcome back. Shalai's Acolyte. A four white angel with one green kicker. Flying. 3-4. If Shia, Shia's Acolyte was kicked... <clears throat> Less said about that, the better. It enters the battlefield with two plus one plus one counters on it. I, I, I don't, I don't know if I feel right about kicking angels or kicking any creature, honestly. But continue. Strength of the coalition. Green one green sorcery instant, instant. It is a green instant. With kicker two white target creature you control gets plus two plus two until end of turn. If this spell is kicked. Put a plus one, plus one counter on each creature you control. We'll just kick all the creatures. Wing Mantle Chaplain. A three white human cleric for zero three with defender. And when Wing Mantle Chaplain enters the battlefield, create a one one white bird creature token with flying for each creature with defender you control. For each creature with defender you control. I know how to read cards. Whenever another creature with Defender enters the battlefield under your control, create a 1 1 White Bird creature token with flying. I'm sorry, I'm having flashbacks of Hitchcock's The Birds. I think they picked the wrong color for that. A stained glass variant of Bartuk Bone Rattler. Four Black Green Troll Shaman Legendary 4 4 with Domain. When Bartuk Bone Rattler enters the battlefield, if you cast it, choose target creature card in your graveyard. Return that card to the battlefield if its mana value is less than or equal to the number of basic land types among lands you control. Otherwise, put it in your hand. Hmm. And we got us a saga. The Elder Dragon War. A two red red saga. Read ahead. Choose a chapter and start with that many lore counters. Add one after your draw step. Skip chapters, don't trigger. Sacrifice after three. Chapter one. The Elder Dragon War deals two damage to each creature and each opponent. Why would you skip that? Chapter two. Discard any number of cards, then draw that many. Chapter three. Create a 4-4 red dragon creature token with flying. That is... That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Beautiful. 
Zar Ojanin, scion of Ephrava. Yeah, no. Uh, it is shiny. It is a shiny three green white cat warrior, legendary cat warrior with 4 4 with domain. Whenever Zar becomes tapped, put a plus one plus one counter on each creature you control with toughness less than the number of basic land types among lands you control. That is also a nasty piece of work. Oh, and we've got something off the list, which is what that little icon means. Old school card, Shield of the Oversoul, two split mana, splitsy splitsy, uh, enchant aura, enchant creature. As long as enchanted creature is green, it gets plus one plus one and is indestructible. Lethal damage and effects that say destroy, don't destroy it. If its toughness is zero or less, it's still put into its owner's graveyard. As long as enchanted creature is white, it gets plus one plus one and has flying. That is, that is a piece of work right there. All right, so final day of Dominaria. Let's see what I like. This one's pretty good. Love this one. Definitely gonna see if I can use get that some play. Uh, that one would be interesting to pull off as a fun deck. Just the birds. Uh, yeah, that one's all right. Them again. <laughs> Solarian. This one's pretty nasty. I mean, it's common nasty, but still nasty. And uh, there we go. That is day three of Dominaria United. I hope you enjoyed it. Tomorrow we'll be uh, back to something different. But in the meantime, stay magical.